everyone. Welcome to SGN's weekly uh, Twitch stream. Uh, every week our community gets together and we do a Twitch stream where we play some games as a community. And uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoy today's stream. We're going to be playing Star Trek Panic, which uh, is a take on Castle Panic, if anyone's actually got the board game or has played this game before. Um, and kind of explain the board game rules in a little bit. Uh, we're pretty pumped to play it. When they say panic, it is a mad panic because it's a really tough game, actually, to, to beat. So we'll explain kind of the rules and everything that's going to happen here in a little bit. I uh, want to introduce Jugu, who is joining and playing with us today, and Nick. Hello. Hi, everyone. All right, so... Um, just before we get started, uh, SGN is a gaming community. If you want to join us, uh, head on over to stonewallgaming.net and uh, sign on up and join us in Discord and whatever games that you like to play. We play a lot of them, including Dead by Daylight, uh, Tabletop Simulator, of course, which we're playing today, uh, Destiny 2, Star Trek Online, and more. All right, so I'm going to explain Star Trek Panic to you, which is uh, basically a cooperative game where Nick... Julian and I are going to survive the onslaught of wave after wave of enemies that are coming at the Enterprise. And uh, while we're doing that, our game objective is to complete five missions. Uh, and here, and uh, so we have to do kind of side objectives while we're also trying to stay alive. Um, so lots of enemies are going to be coming at us wave after wave, and we're pretty uh, excited about, uh, you know, trying to survive. Uh, each of us gets to pick a captain or a character card over here on the side. And uh, so we're going to start by doing that. Each character card gives you a uh, little extra perk kind of thing in terms of uh, during our turnover or turn order, it uh, lets you do something extra. I already stole uh, Scotty. I'm going to be Spock, because it's the only one I really understand. So, Scotty, uh, during the play cards and maneuver phase, I can repair one damaged hull or shield section without playing a card. Can you put that in? Noice. Beautiful. And we're going to need lots of repair, because there's lots of bad people on this. Hi, Tay. Thanks for joining us. Uh, all right, so we're going to get started. Uh, basically, what we do is we have three uh, bad guys that we start off with, and we put them in one, three, and five positions randomly. So, should I roll the dice to make it random? Uh, no, this is where the start for for the starting setup. So the first one's Romulan Battlecruiser. You can see they have uh, two points on the on the card, right? Uh, so it's got two hit points, basically. So we need to hit that uh, for two damage to be able to destroy it. And uh, then the next one is a Klingon Battlecruiser that goes into the three position. A little bit more uh, bulky. It's got three hit points. And then the last, the last one is a Tholian ship, and that one goes over in five. Okay, so everyone's got to draw up five cards. And uh, just put the cards in front of you on the table so we can all see each other's because it's a cooperative game. Okay, let's take a look at my cards. I got uh, long range phasers for the side. Uh, what do you got, Julian? Medium front, short range front, long range rear, as well as the other two tracking, which will help us repair destroyed uh, shields and hulls. Okay, Nick, what do you got? I got medium uh, medium rear, short rear, short side, and multi-range rear. And then a time travel bar. Okay, so who wants to start? Uh, Jillian, do you want to go? You got the green star, so you're up. Uh, 
Alright. Whoa. Okay. The mission card's sideways. Alright, so, it says, uh, mission timer starts at 6. Julian can move the mission timer to 6. So this is the Deadly Years. It's uh, kind of a take on a TOS episode. It is is a TOS episode. Strange disease is causing the crew to age incredibly fast. So what we have to do is... During the mission, current mission timer indicates the maximum number of cards. Active player. Oh! For example, if the mission timer is at 3, the player can only play up to 3 cards in their turn. Uh, otherwise, there's usually no limit. 6, so you can play all of them right now. But each time the mission timer goes down, it limits the number of cards we can play. And we have to commit 1 command credit, 2 science credits, and 2 medical credits to complete the mission and cure the disease. And then we get a reward at the end if we pass the mission. So, if you take a look back at your cards, at the bottom left or right corner of some of the cards, it'll say, okay, this is a command credit. And we have to be able to commit cards to fill that mission parameter. So one command, two science, and two medical is what we need uh, in order to complete the mission. Okay, so that's the new mission. Trade cards, um, let's see here. I have a long range rear. Oh, yes, I will, well, I mean, I can, yeah, what can I give you in exchange? Do you want that one? Thank you. Well, you can, you can use that. I mean, I could. I mean, these are command credits, and we have to give one to it. I'll tell you what, here's what I'm gonna do. You just hang on to yours, we won't trade. I'm gonna commit one command credit right away to this, uh, there we go, to that mission. So we need two science and two medical to go. And then I'm going to, uh, okay, so now we're on play cards and maneuver, so I'm gonna use my long range front phasers. And, um, I've got check off, right? So his ability during play cards and maneuver phase deal one additional damage to one target when attacking with a phaser. It so, also it says also players may not use their special character ability. <sighs> oh no, you're right. Hey, good call on that. Good catch. Okay, so I do one damage with this uh, this one. I'll discard it for you. Thank you. So the Romulan battle cruiser is at one now. Uh, that's the number facing us. Uh, multi-range side phasers, so I'll play this one to damage the Tholian ship, and it's only got, Tholian's only got one, so he's done altogether. Dead, discarded. And I think that's all I can do. Okay, that one's discarded as well? Nope. To range side for that. Wonder Ben. Okay. So then, threats move and fire. So the Romulan battle cruiser comes in and fires and does damage to the shield. It already looks damaged. Yeah. From there we go. Movement. There we go. So that's damaged. Uh, then the one damage to our shield, and that's it. Now, th draw two new threats. Fantastic. Okay, so now I roll the dice. So this goes in quadrant three. Oh no, supernova. Roll the die, rotate the Enterprise that many facings clockwise. Oh, okay. Well, so I did it three, so... One, two, three. Okay. So now, Electromagnetic Storm. Roll the die. If section has no shield, it deals one damage to that hull section. So, I mean, all our sections Oops, have sorry. heals, so we're good. Yay! That was the, that was the easiest one ever. Okay, uh, so I'm done. So, 
at the top, Dave, if you click your name on the center of your screen. There you go. Oh, it's my Next turn. Yay. Okay. All right. So let's see here. Um. I'll use my medium rear sh thing and hit the family cruiser for one and I kill it. You betcha, I'll discard it. Dave, uh, you failed to uh, move the mission timer, I'll move it for you. Thank you. See, it's a group wow. effort. Um, none of my others seem to be in range, so I can't shoot them. Um, I can get my commit my time travel card to oh. the. Yes, let's do that. So that's one medical. So we need two science and one medical left to complete this mission. I um. All right, we don't need any more command credits. Nope. No, I committed right. already. And yep, that's it. All I can do. Okay. Oh. Then you go to check mission status, I guess. Uh, I can be in charge of that. I got it. Okay. So we're down to four now, I guess. Threats move and fire. And so just move that guy a little bit closer. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, I guess, I guess I'll do it. <laughs> he fires. And so we've got damage to our shield there now, too. And then... Draw two new threats. So just hover over the panic bag and hit the number two. Should draw two new threats. And then without looking at them, just roll the dice and then put them in the quadrant, uh, the long range quadrant of, uh, of whichever one first. If that makes sense. <gasps> oh no. So Kang's battle cruiser, that's a special card you can you can see because it has uh, um, you know red on the outside. And so we look at the side of the board. So Kang's battle cruiser, after placement, all Klingon ships fire and cloaked ships uncloak and fire. Okay, so after he's placed, which is now basically he fires, damages that shield. This this Klingon ship fires too. Where's our shield? Uh oh, we got a border now. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. But now you have to draw two new threats and put them on the board. Oh wait, yeah, you just did that. Sorry, my bad. Yep. And then well, I've got the Ion Storm. So I'm gonna roll this. One, and it goes here then. All right, so we can just discard that. All right, well, it's not looking great. And then just hit done when you're done your turn. The panic is just beginning. Top of your screen, there you go. Oh, there you go. All right, well, thanks for uh, that. <laughs> kind of, not really. <laughs> I'm just gonna take a quick look around the board here. See if there's anything of value that you guys have. Uh, anybody have a short range front? No. I don't, but I have long range side, which might be handy. I might. Oh, I have a medical card I can commit next turn, actually, so then we would just need two signs left. I do have a sign. One science. The, uh, engineering card but together i can fix with those two i can fix completely that broken shield that i'm tempted to do thoughts i think you should just go quickly oh do you want my long range phases or not before you start did you yeah sure yeah i'll take the long range there you go All right, sounds good. So first up, I am gonna use my Delithium and Tritanium to repair that shield. Dave, can you repair that shield for me? Sorry, which which one? The one that's completely gone. You can reset it to back to normal. To full strength? I believe so. I don't think so. I think it just is one facing, right? Well, one repair. Setting. 
Repair one damage shield or play with Tritanium to rebuild one destroyed hollow. So, no, no, no. So it only repairs the damage shield. It doesn't bring it back from being destroyed. I played I played it with the Tritanium. Oh, uh, okay. All right. So... Reset, please. All right. All right. We'll trust I you're know. doing it properly. Okay. <laughs> uh, short range front. So you can uh, turn that unit. Long range side, you can turn that unit. The carbon unit? Yes. Yep. Maybe. All right. Uh, and now I. So you don't have anything to commit to that, eh? No, I repaired that shield because okay. I knew we were going to end up with a border here. Uh, check mission status. Okay, so we can only play up to three cards now, or I can. Up to three cards? Well, that's part of the mission, is you can only play as many cards per turn as the mission status timer is. So we're at three now, so you can only play three cards per turn. Hmm, did I not play just five cards now? <laughs> well, okay, we're gonna give it a bu we're gonna give it a pass. <laughs> All right, fair enough. All right, so draw two new threats. Julian's a cheater. Wow. Oh, wow. Three. Okay. That goes into three. Is it cloaked or something? Um, yes, yeah, so that should be cloaked, right, Jules? I don't know if they cloak right on the first, but I think it's on the second. Hmm. Okay. I think they move forward, fire, and then cloak or something, don't they? Uh oh, the next one. Have a... Which goes in three. So the comet. Dave, do you remember what the comet does? Yes, it goes through and like destroys the shield section, I'm pretty sure. It does two it damage, just, right? It's got two damage. Flies, in, flies immediately at the Enterprise. It destroys all non-mission threats in its path and deals two damage to the Enterprise. Ooh! Oh. I mean, hey, that works. You sure went into ring three, too? Yeah, I rolled I rolled, rolled twice. Yep. Well, shit, so that destroys the Romulan. Destroys the Klingon. And then it also destroys our ship. Which is minor. Sounds like a good trade to me. Did you just drop that off the table? Maybe. <laughs> okay. All right then, my turn, I think, if you <laughs> finish up. Yeah, okay, I've got uh, one card, so I drop four. Oh, did, uh, wait, 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 wait. You rushed me. The threats did not move in fire yet. Oh. Yep. Okay, go ahead. Nah, this threat, this one needs to move. Yeah, that's the only one that I didn't move. Pew! And destroys the shield. No bueno. Okay, so we need uh, one medical, which, uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, so we need a medical, so I'll commit my medical to this. So that means we just need two science left to complete this mission, right? You do have a science as well. Yeah, I do have a science, so I'll put that there. Now, I can only play one more card because of the mission thing. Um, Does committing a card count as playing? Nah, probably not. But I don't have anything to do anything with, so, you know... Did you trade? You didn't trade cards, did you? No. I can repair one damage shield, though. Be good. Yeah, let's do that. I can't bring it back from the dead, but I can repair like a damage shield, which I'll do this one maybe. Yeah, and then you can always rotate it. Uh, yeah, I could maneuver now. 
next, right? There we go. So at least we have that shield facing facing our enemy. Uh, Julian, check mission status, please. Yoink. Two left. Threat moves and fires. Damages that shield, and I think that's it. Now I gotta draw two new threat. No, we already moved it forward one. Oh no, that was for Julian. Okay. So this goes in ring two. It's a Tholian. Damn Tholians. At least they're nice and easy. Just one hit point. A temporal disruption. Roll the die to move the mission timer. Oh no! One to three is down one. Four to six is up one. Give it a good toss. No! Uh Nick, you have to commit a science uh, credit to the next one, otherwise we're fucked, so hopefully you get one in your pickup. We're what? We're foobard. Uh, you removed the Tholian. You removed the Tholian. Well, crap. You removed... How do I undo that? Hang on. Hold on, I got it. Oh, no. Okay, I got her. I got her. Okay, there we go. Your turn. All right, uh, and then draw two. Uh, well, you draw up to a hand of five, right? So if you have four, then draw one, etc. You should have five in your hand. That's not a science. Does anybody nope. have a science in their hand right now? I do not. Oh no, we're gonna fail the mission. <laughs> All right, go ahead and play. The threat token, like the the person, like the ship. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just use this command card, Elliot, and I can remove one command credit or one command or threat token. There we go. I'll get rid of this stupid thing. Yay! <sighs> Not great. We were so close to finishing that mission. Um. And that's all I can do, right? I can only use one card. Much. All right. Check mission status. Well, you can maneuver the Enterprise if you want. Probably not. Uh, check mission status, Jules. Womp, womp, womp. Failure. Um, threats move and fire. Oh, what did I do? Here? You move the entire stack. All right, so the Tholian moves in and fires, destroys by her shield, unfortunately. Again. Oh. And then you draw two new threats. Got those threats there, Nick? Oh, yeah, sorry. Focus, man, focus. Oh. What do we got? <gasps> oh no. Boss battle cruiser. So, after placement, all Klingon ships move one sector closer to the Enterprise. However, cloak Klingon ships remain the same. So, thankfully, we don't have any Klingon ships on there besides that one. So. He just moves one, one, one place closer. Hey Jules, while you're moving, I'm going to read the rule book there and just figure out what the cloak ships do again. It says on the corner of the board, Dave. Yeah, but did, okay. On the other corner. Uh, let's see. Cloaking ships. On threats, move and fire. Each uncloaked ship advances and cloaks. Cannot fire or be hit. But it'll move forward to sector 2 and then cloak. Uh, and then for cloaked ships, roll the die for either position, and then they either stay where they are, go clockwise or counterclockwise and fire. Okay, alright. So we don't have to worry about that right now. All good? Go next. Oh, Let's go, yeah, Jules. I drew up here in a second. 
Do we need to pull uh, another mission card? Yeah, that's my next thing. All right, hopefully we got a better mission this time. All right, go ahead, Dad. X, a psychic teenage passenger, takes over the Enterprise. Uh, mission parameters: timer starts at four. Julian. Done. Players may not maneuver the Enterprise, and if Yeoman Rand appears in a player's hand, discard her immediately. Mission objective: You have to commit three command credits, two science credits, and one medical to complete the mission and transport Charlie back to his guardians. And if we complete it, then the reward is rotate the Enterprise to a facing of your choice and search a discard pile for Yeoman Rand and add her to the active player's hand. Uh, this is going to be a tough one. That's a lot of credits in, in just four. Alright, well I I just committed three cards here. We still need three command cards, but I got two science and one medical. Then. Oh, sweet! Alright then. Also, I am going to um use uh, Scotty and how do I repair stuff again? Um, so use page up or down when you're hovering over the shield. There you go. Wait, no, that's destroyed completely. I can't. Yep. There you go. Yay. Okay, we got a shield back. Yay. And I have for weapons, I have long range rear which doesn't do anything good for me nope and we can't maneuver the enterprise in this mission i have a medium range rear phaser if you want to trade and you can use it to the alien. sorry it's too late to too late trade oh. but i am going to use my dilithium and repair that uh, other down shield here okay go oh, there we go i'm good now check the mission um, status check mission down to three. All right. Tr threats move and fire, correct? Mm-hmm. Oh, no! Can you place that thing? It's going to be the... Yeah. The there we go. Damage on the nacelle, Captain. <laughs> okay. This one's already destroyed. The other... Oh, no. That's the... Aft of the saucer. After right. Sorry, what are we, oh, oh. For this one. On the saucer? Wait, 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 is that I don't think so. cloaked right now or what? Yeah, so he doesn't actually fire. He moves forward and cloaks. Then you need to flip over for that? Yeah, be cloaked. Hit, hit F. Uh, yes, but... there you go. He'll, he'll fire next turn. Um, He's also supposed to move quadrants. Uh, he will next turn, I think, doesn't he? For cloak shifts, roll. Oh okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it wasn't cloaked. Yeah. Move and damage the. Damage. There we go. Okay, that's not good. No boy, no. All right, drop two, two new threats. Yes, please. So I just want to draw your attention to the fact that we have, uh, you know, uh, no missions completed. You guys oh, kind of well, suck at this game, sorry. don't you? Um, so I have a system overlord, uh, overload. Sorry, I almost went to Starcraft and said Overlord. Uh, we need to discard each one hit one. Pardon? You heard me. Like that. Okay, and the other one is a Romulan battle cruiser. Two. Uh, no, that's a six there, sport. Six. Okay, okay. It's okay. There's I mean, worse. we committed a lot of cards to that mission. We just need two command, right? Or three command. Oh, shit. Are you done? Yar. All right, what have we got here? All 
Alright, I got a couple short range phasers, which will do good thing. Dead. Okay. Dave, you have six cards in front of you. Don't. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I didn't see that one. So I think the last one then. Okay. <laughs> Just put that back there. Uh, okay, well, I've got one command, so we just need two left. I'll. Here. All right, then. Uh, play cards and maneuver. I guess we can't maneuver. Check mission status. Bring us down to you two. Is that the you can fire? Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Sorry. I was doing that. I was doing that. Okay, so I'll use my rear arc, short range rear. Destroy the Tholian. Yay! Uh, then I got short range front phaser. Bring Koloth down to two. Then I'm gonna play no sensor contacts. Uh, it says, do not draw any threat tokens this turn. <laughs> Yay! Yay! All right, but unfortunately now things move and fire and stuff. It's where we die. Uh, so Koloth has two. So what happens here, Jules? He does two. Uh, no, the, the, no, you don't need to, because uh, there's still hull. So now you got to destroy that hull. Completely. Destroy the hull, right? Yeah. Oh no, look at that beautiful saucer section destroyed. Yar. And then he right. goes away, right? Um, no, he'll go away next turn if we don't destroy him, but then we'll have to start discarding some actual Enterprise cards. You sure? Because he's a border now, isn't he? Uh, uh yeah. They, they move and fire. He moved and fired. So he, was, he became a border. Did two damage, so we actually have to technically discard one card. Alright, so on page 13 of the manual. A threat starting in short range during the threat's move and fire phase will become a border if there is no shield defense. Exactly. That when a threat becomes a border, its current defense is applied immediately as the damage dealt to the home. Which was two. So one da the sec one damage destroyed the section, and then we lose a card. Then the threat token is discarded. Discarded, so we just have to discard a card from the deck. If the section has, a, uh, uh, if the section border enters already has a destroyed indicator on it, the damage is resolved the same way. Hits destroyed all sections are by removing cards permanently from the enterprise deck. That's what I told you. So do we lose? But one. There was two. You lose one because he did damage. He destroyed the hull, right? And then we lose one card because he had two hits. I'm gonna put it in the trash because we just gotta be discarded okay. permanently. Okay, yeah, yeah, fair enough. Did you discard? Uh, did you grab that from the top of the deck? Yes. Okay. Hmm. All right. So uh, this one moves forward and does damage. I need. I needed to discard a card. <gasps> no, 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 no. Not me. No, so the discard comes from the deck as a whole, like the remaining cards. Not from your hand. Ah. Okay. Okay, so. Does damage. There we go. And uh, then we gotta roll the dice for this cloak chip. Three. So, if uh, cloaked. Roll the die for position to uncloak. If it's three, it stays where it is. Oh no, and it does two damage. Oh no, no, just one damage. It's not a round one, it's a Klingon. Okay, well, we've got another part destroyed. It doesn't seem like you guys are very good at this game. Jeez. Well, when you bring in your fire. Mm -hmm. 
There we go. So once we get to three s destroyed sections, we can't move the Enterprise until we start fixing it. So we're at two right now, right? Yeah. All right. Uh, well, the threats moved and fired. Draw two new threats, but I played Spock that did no new threats this time. So... Your hey. turn, Hank. Well, I've got uh, this command card. I can donate to the <gasps> nice. to the cause. Dave didn't make me move the mission status timer, so I'll do it now. Thank you. Um. Uh, do you want to trade with anybody? Well, I've got a medium range. Any fa side phasers, so that'll do. What will that do? Will that'll, that do one that'll damage? Do one damage to one of them. To, to one, just one. Well, that. That's only that's two cards, right? That's all I can do. Uh, nope, no, no. So that whole two cards thing was only the last mission, right? Each mission oh, has some okay. parameters. Yeah. So we're on a new mission now. Okay. See, like. Well, uh, well, then well, that's that's trade. Anyone have any other medium range? I just have a short side phase. <laughs> I got nothing, <laughs> I used them all. You guys both suck. Um, doo -doo -doo. There's nothing, I can't hit any of the others, right? No, there are no, my arcs. Uh, no, but I'll, uh, yeah. Julian will probably trade right. with you for those uh, short range sides later. Yeah. So, all right. hit that one to one. Alright, that. Go. Check mission status. Which one turn one? left. We just need one more command credit, that's it. Well, and then I get draw, to draw two. five cards, so. Two new threats. Oh, yay, a new Klingon. Did, they didn't move and fire yet. You gotta move and fire first. Oh. Yeah, easy there, sports fan. All right, so Romulan battle cruiser moves and fires, and because we have a destroyed hull, we lose, um, yeah, a card from the deck. And then this guy, this one moves forward and cloaks. And he doesn't fire. Oh no, no, no! It was good, whatever facing it was. It was at one, one house. Yeah. yeah, you just All cloak right. it. There you go. Beautiful. Now two new threads. Um, that's interesting. When we flip it, it changes the value. That's what fine. We knew see. what it was at. Okay. Okay, there's this. Goes in six. Everything's going in six. That's a five. That's a five. Okay. It goes in five. Thankfully. We actually have shields in five. Magnetic storm. Roll, die, and rotate the Enterprise. One sector counter clockwise. Somebody want to roll it, rotate it for me. Four dice. Uh, four. Where does that put us? It's uh, rotate counterclockwise. Clockwise. No sector clockwise. Oh, great! So, <laughs> you know. At least we have shields in that region now. Uh, in this region, I guess. On the bright side, that one will just cloak and move forward next. Alright. All done, Nick? Uh, yeah. Okay. Wait. Let's hope you get a command credit. We really need it. Oh! Ah, oh, well, I can use my special ability. I have a command card. Oh, thank God. All right, first things first. Uh, drop, yeah, reveal new mission. Yeah, trade card, let's see. What do you guys have for... Maybe I got short range card? rear, which we don't need. Up on the front. No 
long range front, eh? All right. So, I'll just start playing. Thank you. Numero R. Command card. Done. Nice. So, I will put our mission credit right there. One done. Four to go. Okay. So, the reward. Rotate the Enterprise and to a facing of your choice and search the discard pile for Yeoman Rand and her to activate uh, uh, the active player's hand. So, she... I don't think we've ever had her or discarded her, so I don't think we get anything from that. But we can okay. rotate the Enterprise wherever you like. Okay. You know what? I, it might be We're good where we are. <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, so sweet. I'm going to leave that there. But at the end of the day, at least that mission's done. Since we finished a mission, can't we just like go to Starbase now and completely mm -hmm. there? <laughs> no. Either that or it's end credits, right? All right, with Scotty, uh, Dave, can you uh, repair the rear left? Remove that damage. There you go. Yeah. No, no, oh, no. Oh, from the hull. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. No, thank you for repairing, Scotty. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. You know what? I should. Can we still rotate? I guess. Come from our reward. Where do you want to rotate? One uh, facing, that's all you can do, right? Yeah, but if you, uh, no, it says to anywhere of your choice. Okay, yeah, rotate Enterprise to any facing of your choice. All right, fair okay. enough. Put the aft facing, like, rotate at 180. No, that's too much. Yeah. But I mean, so our exposed section, that's... That's okay, don't worry about it. I am worried about it. Well, I'm not. It's okay. All right. With right. the fire. Reduced one to this. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> okay. Reduce two to this one. Um, well, hang on. Isn't that just a forward arc? That is forward arc. Fuck. Julian, what Sorry. have you done I, to us? I thought that was rear arc. <laughs> All of your stuff is oh, forward arc. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> hmm. Well, um, can we undo When you said, don't worry about it? <laughs> ah, don't worry about it. Oh dear. Oh goodness. Dave, what have you done? <laughs> Alright. Well, so much for that. Mission status is complete. Good. Uh, next Threats is... Threats moving fire. This should be fun. Okay, so this one does two damage and destroys the hull, thanks to you. <laughs> that's, fu that's fine. And it's, uh, it, it's a border now, so it disappears after you damage it. Destroy it. Yeah, but we can't move anymore. That's fine. Don't worry about it. This one moves forward. Wait, how do I flip? Okay, this other one, uh, we gotta roll. Mm -hmm. Two makes it clockwise. Sorry, go ahead. And that was at one. Yep. Yeah. And it does damage. There you go. Draw two new threats. See, this is where the panic comes in. And I bet you the next mission is going to make us move somewhere where we can't move. Here we are. Okay, I got a Romulan Bell Cruiser. One. Okay, should have brought two of those. I have a special ability on my guy. Oh, it just only works when it's my turn. I imagine. Yeah. Yes. All right. Well, I've star never base. used. Well, you should think what, about it. What does the starbase do? Nick, it's on your corner. Oh no! It repairs like significant stuff, but the problem is, is that we need to move to it, which we can't because of all that damage to the ship. Players, 
do not move or fire does not move or fire players maneuver it into a short range for rewards There How we do we maneuver it? Well, so we have to move forward to it, right? And then it moves forward to us. Makes sense. But we can't maneuver the Enterprise currently because of all the damage to it. We've got three destroyed sections. Because someone... <laughs> all right. Uh, is that two new threats? You got that? All good? Yes. All right. Drawing up. All right, so I got short range, any facing, tricorder. Look at the top five decks, the air cards in the Enterprise deck. Keep one, put the rest. Uh, tractor beam, move one threat in any direction. Ooh, uh, medium side and short range rear. Okay. So what's the first one? It's just white to me. Yeah, for me it's white. It's short range, any facing phasers. So uh, it's uh, it's full circle around the ship. Okay, well, does anybody have medium range uh, phasers at all uh, for the sides or for the back? I mean, I do. But, uh, I'm gonna trade. Oh. Yeah, I'll trade you for short range rear if that works for you. Dave, you can't shoot on a cloaked ship. Yeah, well, oh yeah, I suppose I. My bad. Okay, well, I guess reveal new mission. No, 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 you can use your medium range all, or your short range all facing and get rid of that. But we reveal one. new missions first in the turn order. Yeah, yeah, so you should reveal a new mission. <laughs> hey. Come on, Dave. Right? <laughs> all right, the immunity syndrome. A single-celled life form threatens to destroy the galaxy. <gasps> Mission timer at five, Jules. Uh, roll the die and then place the space amoeba in that long-range sector. The space amoeba does not move or fire. Plays, uh, players may not repair or rebuild shields during the mission. Oh no. <laughs> players must maneuver the Enterprise so that the space amoeba is in short range and commit two phasers of any kind in one day lithium. This completes the mission. Launching an antimatter charge in the amoeba's chromosome-like body. So, maneuvering is going to be a bit of a problem, <laughs> unless we rebuild. All right. We can't rebuild. So, well, we, we can't rebuild shields, but we can can do hull, which once the hull is rebuilt, uh, and we're down to two destroyed sections, we can move again. Okay, so I got to roll the dice. Anyone see the dice? Right in front of you. Give it a good roll. Come on, three. Oh no, six. Space amoeba. Where is it? There we go. All right, so we have to rotate the Enterprise towards six and then forward towards it to get this mission done. <laughs> if only we hadn't rotated the ship. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, let me see. Let's deal some damage. Use my medium or no short range any facing phaser. Destroy this. Hey. Uh, yeah. Um, All right. Yeah. I think that's all I could do. Yep, I'm pretty sure that's it. I could play my tricorder, I guess. Look at the top five cards of the Enterprise deck. Keep one in your hand, return the rest. Or save it as like a medical or science. I'll probably save it for now. Okay. Uh, what do we need to do for the mission? Rotate the Enterprise towards the amoeba. And then we have and to move forward to the amoeba. And then we have to commit two phaser cards and one science card to destroy it. Okay. Should I check the mission status? Please do! Okay, threats move and fire. Pew, pew, pew. So, Romulan <laughs> Battlecruiser destroys our sh 
And then I roll this. It's five, so which way is that? Clockwise? Counterclockwise. It doesn't move forward, though. Oh, doesn't it? Okay. No, that's the next one. Is it two or one? Who I think? I don't think two. we've hit it. Oh. All right, and it fires, and we have to discard a card. Pew, pew, pew. I've been putting it way over the... You got destroyed. No, that's the ship tokens. Well, that didn't matter. They go, so I've been putting them over here, Dave. That's fine, that's fine. Uh, here. Turns out that thing is uh, trash, I think. Yeah, but I couldn't put anything in there. All right, that's all right. Don't mind. Two new threats. Here we go. This one goes into quadrant six. And this one goes into two, but it's a special one. Ugh. Uh, after placement, all Klingon ships gain one defensive value, never exceeding their starting value. Okay, well, good news! <laughs> Yay! Your turn! Yay! Alright, what do I do? Draw up, okay. Oh, Take oh two. man, our poor Enterprise. Ooh, Nick, I do have a two-hit forward facing. If I could, uh... Kind of impact that thing on ship there. Um, I got the lithium. Should I commit it to the mission, or should I save it to repair? Or repair? Well, let's take a look at this logically. We'd have to rotate the Enterprise once, twice, and then two more times, four times in total, uh, to be able to complete the mission. What's our mission timer at? Four. So section and yeah I mean we could technically do it if everyone if we're able to repair a section and don't take Actually, any more damage we're at three, Dave. oh crap okay we're at three so it, no don't commit it to the mission we can't complete the mission that's just stay alive so okay so repair one damage shield or play play to rebuild uh, should I just go ahead and repair one damage on the shield? Well, so Julian says that he mis was mistaken and we're actually at four for the mission timer, so we could. Yeah. But we have to fully repair a hull to be able to rotate anyways, and nope. without tritanium, you can't. You don't have to fully repair it, do you? The yeah, to, to bring it back even to damaged or whatever. No. No, okay. Okay, no, just do the shield then. Um, well, I could I could trade the the, the, the tritanium off to uh, or dilithium off to Julian and then uh and then he can keep it for future use. And then I can use this that thing to do sure. that to do things. Uh, mhm. Mm okay, let's do things. Let's do them. Let's uh, keep trading. Um, does anyone else have? Uh, you've got uh, got a medium side. side. You, you want to trade me that for a high spur? Oh, we can only trade one card per turn. No, yeah. I don't think so. Okay, Julian says yes, only one card per turn. <laughs> okay, so uh, I'll use this to do two damage to the little core up here. Good old core. And that breaks him down to one. One. Uno. Um. Uh, really? Like, I have three different ranges and not a single one I can use. Mm hmm. <laughs> I started carbonated beverage up my nose. <laughs> not where it's supposed to go. Dude. Because of your misfortune. Alright, I guess that's all I can do. All you right, know what else you can that? do is you can check the mission status, and then threats move and fire. <laughs> I don't want threats to move and fire. <laughs> Alright, 
Alright, so, uh... Tholian moves yep. forward one, right? Yep. He doesn't destroy. fire, though. Sure he does. I'll take care of destroying that. Oh, I just did. No, you put it in the discard. Sorry, go ahead. Okay, next. Alright, and then this guy moves forward, the battle cruiser. He fires. Mm -hmm. Wait, what does it mean? Um, Another discard? That's the, nope, that's the damage on the rear left hull of Saucer. I just want to add that bit of damage. Done! Yay! <laughs> and then this guy moves forward one. Card. King yet? <laughs> I'm very panicked. Alright, and then this guy. Uh, what does he do? He needs to uh, uh, move forward and cloak. Forward and cloak, yeah. Boom. And now All draw right. two new threats. Alright, since I'm Spock, I can draw three threats and I only. and I can only. Okay. Oh shoot, what did I do? I shuffled. Yeah, just, uh, just hit three, you're right. Uh, what's the two on the Romulan Bird of Prey mean? Does two damage when it shoots. Alright, so I'm gonna get rid of that one. Okay. And then I'm gonna... The, the Klingon Bird of Prey. Roll. What the fudge? <laughs> yeah, it says four. Okay. So this goes in four. Uh, Alright, and now we've got a comment. Let's figure out where the heck it goes. Please, roll. Please roll two. One! Oh no. That's all it does. I'll destroy that at least. Um, then... Discard a card, Jules. Just one card because it does two damage. Um, I guess two. Whoops. All right. But that was the last one, so yeah, we just have to reshuffle this deck now. Holy crap! What are you doing? I accidentally just I picked up. Yeah. You picked up the whole pile. No, but that was the last one. That's why you picked up the whole pile. No, there's seventeen. Okay, that's me. I'm done. Okay. Jules, your turn. Yeah, I'm just, uh... Okay, this. so I'm reshuffling the discard, yes? Nope, that wasn't the whole... I accidentally picked... You see next to the... Next to you? Those 15 cards, yeah. We need to flip that. Okay. All right. The 15 cards, yeah, are back. Okay. Okay. All right. Good. So yeah, that's amazing. All right. Fantastic. All right. Draw up. I need two cards. I'm panicking! <laughs> mm, great, what do I look like? What do you have, Dave? So I have a tractor beam that'll move a target in any facing over one. Um, Tricorder, we'll look at the top five cards in the Enterprise deck, keep one, return the rest to the deck. I'm going to steal Nick's. Okay with Nick, yep. either the short range, medium range rear, or the long range side. Either is fine with me. All right, thank you. How many times did you trade with me? Just once. I brought you a Dilithium card, and I uh, took your medium range rear. rear. Oh, 
Okay, move along then. Yeah, medium rear. Destroy the Tholian? Oh god. Yeah. Against the founding principles of the Federation. <laughs> um, long range front doesn't do anything. Medium range front, yeah. Yay! Okay, he's dead. That's nice. What does the security teams do again? Reduce that the removes border borders. Out. So it reduces damage from borders. Okay, threats move and fire. I. Uh, they're over here. Mission timer. Okay. Uh, good. So that one cloaks and move forward. This one. I... Roll the dice. Two. Clockwise, right? Yep. Uh, we have shield in there. there. There we go. Nice. I don't know how it's we nice. still have shield. Nice to see a damage shield. <laughs> All right. Uh, two new threats. Blah, blah, blah. I think two new threats. Yay! Okay, first one is Ramelin back at Battle Cruiser. Well, at least we've done all the special ships. Those are done. For now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The other one's a Klingon Bird of Prey. All right, go ahead. Do you think? All right, drop one card. Oh no. Okay, we're gonna have to trade. Does anybody have side long range? No. Yes, I do. Oh, can I trade you for like short range rear or something? Sure. No, 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 no. Wait, actually, you could use short range rear and hit this. Oh, uh... crap, yeah, I didn't even see him. Sorry. Yeah, we'll just stay where we're at, I guess. Oh, Dave, with your checkoff. Oh, yeah, nice. Uh, how about, can I give you a medium range side? Because the they'll be in medium range next, and I'll take the long range sure. side. Sounds good to me. There we go. All right. Uh, play cards and maneuver. Well. Let's see what I got. I got short range rear. Use that along with after my player card uh, for the first time in this game. I get to do one additional damage with uh, phaser. Nice. So I'll use that and I'll destroy, destroy this fucker. Language. <laughs> then I'll use the long range side phasers and take this guy down? Yeah. Take that guy down to one. Then you know what I'm going to do. I'm gonna use my tractor beam. Move one threat facing, or er, threat token, one facing in any direction. I'm going to drag the Klingon bird of prey over there. And then I'm going to use my multi range front phasers to take him down to one. Nice. Oh, we could have destroyed that one completely. Yeah, well, I also destroyed the one in the back, so, you know. I had a great guy. Then I'm going to use my tricorder to take a look at the top five cards of the Enterprise deck, keep one in your hand, return the rest. Oh. I'll use, uh, I'll take this, return the rest. Oh, not the multi range front well um, i mean that does two damage i know it does but we only need one really okay. i'm gonna blow him out of the sky no because it's gonna because then it'll end up in the discard pile oh, okay all right do you want me to put those back there we go and i'll use the long range front phasers and destroy the bird of prey. Nice. 
Okay, threats, uh, move and fire. Mission failed. Yeah, mission's done. Failure. This one um, moves, fires, and destroys another section of the ship. I mean, we can remove this space amoeba. Yeah, it goes back to the side of the board. Uh, the USS Enterprise has seen better days. It sure has. Shit, captains. All right, um, two new threats, right? No, thank you. <laughs> uh, sick. There you go. There's something wrong, alright. What's up? The rear damage shield? That can't be that we have damage. Yeah, it was. Shield. Not, well, you can't have the shield here. Yeah. Right, yeah. Well, well, we'll just keep going. Somehow it happened. Must have been Off we go. Alright, so I draw up. So uh. if we lose two more sections of the ship, we're done. Uh, reveal new mission. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. Gosh. Oh, okay. The trouble with triples. Oh no! The Enterprise is overflowing with triples. Timer at six. You cannot trade cards during this mission. Players must oh. maneuver the Enterprise. <laughs> oh no! So that a Klingon ship is in short range. Okay, 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 well the, the Klingon ship might just advance to short range and commit two command credits, one science credit, one engineering, and one medical credit. Then the triples are beamed to the Klingon ship. So, basically what we need is we need to have all those in place and put the last one in place when the Klingon, when a Klingon ship is in short range. Let's do this. Medical and science. We're all counting on you, Nick. Good I luck. can do almost nothing. Okay, well, I can, um, hold on, let's see here. Um, I have medium range. I can do that. Short range. Yeah, I can do almost nothing. Literally use anyone all my cards. I have no. And you can't trade. You can't trade during this uh, mission, right? Wow, oh, son of a bitch. Okay, well, I'll use this. Yes. And you destroy that guy at least. Well, that's something. You could do nothing. Come on. Nothing. <laughs> um. All right. I still have this dilithium, so it's an engineering credit, or I can rebuild something. Yeah. Yeah, but you need Tritanium to work with the Dilithium. So... You gotta draw it up yourself. So I would commit it as like a credit. There we go, that's engineering. And then here, here's a science. <gasps> oh! Medical. That's a medical. Medical, yeah. Okay. Uh, check mission status. Julian, down to five. Threats a move and fire. Uh, you have to get rid of a card, Jules. Yep, got it. Uh, this one moves and fires. And then, Nick, you have to roll the dice for the cloaked. Or 
Five. Where does that put it? Five is counterclockwise. So, here? We have shields. Mm -hmm. And it was at two, right? Mm-hmm. And I flip. Does it move forward too, Jules? No. I no. Okay. 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 So one more card. Uh, Actually, nope. no, 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 we had shield. Wow. We had shield. Take that card, put it back. Jesus, where are you going? That was a good well, card too. I know. I'll keep it. I got to drop next time. Um, is that all of them? Two new threats. That, I mean, did I move all the cards? Yep. Or yep, is yep. It? All right. All right. I oh, there's only three left of the thing. Oh no. Draw. Draw. I can oh, draw no. three. And I get a. Put it draw. in a new bag bag. And I get this. What back? What? Well, you put it in the discard. It just goes back in the regular. Oh, sorry. That's okay. Roll. Three. three. This guy goes in three. Roll. Is that a six? That's yeah. a five. That's a five. Oh, and this guy goes. Fun times. Did we check the mission status, by the way? No, but now we did. Okay. Okay. All right, and your turn. Okay, I need to draw one more card. Oh, that's um, cool. our phasers are kind of shit, man. Never seem to be able to hit a target. Well, yes. I blame Scotty. All right. We all blame Scotty. With my Scotty that you're all blaming, I'm gonna repair the shield. Oh, Scotty, my best friend. <laughs> I am going to commit one command card. And it has a picture of Scotty on there, so once again. All right, and st I am going to use, let's see. I'm gonna use these two cards. To destroy. And medium side, there's nothing there. Okay, that's that's everything. Move and fire. Oh, mission status. There you go. Move and fire. All right. We'll just count the cards. I'll take care of them after. One. Two, three cards. This one moves forward and cloaks. You come out of the draw pile, not the discard pile. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, two new threats, please. We need to shuffle and... Uh, but take the last one in this one, I guess. Let's, no, take put in the discard. Hmm. Not sure how to move him back. I mean... Yeah. It says retint to blue to make the new threat bag when you run out of threats. Tint the other bag oh, black. Hold on, hold on. I've been moving things over. Okay, so they're all back all right. in. Yeah. There you go. Okay, no tint the other one. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> mm. 
Well, that's very okay. Just leave it. <laughs> <laughs> the yeah, we should have just move them over. All right, the first one is Rumble and Bird of Prey. It's it's visible to me now. Oh my God, what the hell happened? Oh, hang on. Sorry, there you go. Okay, okay. okay. So this is my turn. But yeah, no. you're you're going up. One. The other one's there. It's just invisible-ish. Okay. It's completely retinted to really I tried to retint it. Um. My turn. Alright, uh, I get to draw five cards, I guess. There's only three left in the deck, though. So I gotta reshuffle the. I'll take care of it. There you go, I've been shuffled. Alright, here's what I got Yeoman Rand? <laughs> Wait, where did my Yeoman Rand go? How the, do you do that? That's neat. Yeah, I just went to my hand and then I... Well... Alright, so I got... Um, what do we need left for the mission? One we need a science and a command. Sweet! Science... And command and... No. No, that's it! All uncloaked Klingon ships on the board take one damage. Dave, you'll take care of that? I will, I'm doing that right now. He's down to two. He's down to two. Romulan. Jules, you got that one? I got it. Look, All right. Thank you. Line. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, all good. Oh, that one's clean. Yeah. Cling on. This one here. Oh, did it say uncloaked? Yeah. Yep. So that one doesn't do it. Where does the beige kick in? Oh, there'll be so much beige after the game. Okay, two missions, three to go. <laughs> Yay! And, uh, yeah. We need a, and you got rid of a Tritanium, which we could have rebuilt something. Yeah, well, we, we needed to finish that mission. All right. We got long-range side phasers. Uh, I got medium-range rear. Oh, which one do you think I... So, I mean, the Romulan's going to cloak this turn, right? And won't hit us, but it does two damage. I would get rid of that. Either that, or I could get rid of the Klingon Battlecruiser over there. Yeah, but that one's going to take two cards out every time. Okay, alright. So, I'll use the... Long range side. Along with my checkoff to destroy this guy. In the invisible bag. In the invisible bag. <laughs> then I'll use my oh. medium range uh, rear phasers. Do one damage to the thing on Battlecruiser. Ooh. Then I'm going to use my long range front phasers to take this guy down to one. Okay, we've done some damage. I mean, you can thank me for that. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we need two new threats, right? No. <laughs> Alright, roll the die. Oh dear. Okay, so it's it's going to destroy. 
destroy the ship, at least. Hold on. Comet fires immediately if it destroys all non-mission threats in its path and deals two damage to Enterprise, shield, or hull. Yeah. Yep. So, shield's destroyed, but it also gets rid of that ship, and then which is nice. put one damage to that hull. No, 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 because it destroyed the shield. Yeah, but... It's... It was a fall. The shield was a fall. Two damages to... Andrew... Oh, was it? Okay, cool. Shield was Sweet. a fall. Uh, nice. And then number six. Okay, uh, I think that's it for me. Did we... We didn't move and fire before you put those. What are you... Alright, my turn. Draw up. Mission card? Oh, it's a new mission time. Alright, let's see what we got. It's an alien encounter. Alright. Four. Ascension cloud of pure energy takes over the Enterprise. Oh, this happens all the time. Uh, mission timer starts at four. Players may not maneuver the Enterprise. Well, no problem there. Instead, at the start of each player's uh, playing cards maneuver, you roll one die. If it's 1 to 3, rotate the Enterprise 1 facing clockwise, 4 to 6 counterclockwise. Mission objective, must commit uh, 3 phaser cards, 1 engineering credit, and 1 dilithium to... dissipate the cloud? I do have dilithium, I have an enge er, engineering, I would just need... So no, you need I have, 3 yeah. phaser cards, 1 engineering, 1 science, right? No, 1 dilithium. 1 dilithium, yeah. okay, my bad. I have the dilithium. Let's see what kind of damage I can do. Um, uh, well, if I think you got to roll the dice, right? For what? Uh, so from the mission, instead of the start of each player's play cards and maneuver phase, roll the dice. One to three rotates the Enterprise one oh, phase and clockwise. Okay. Four to six counter. One. So one was clockwise, right? There you go. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, so let's see what I can do. So now I can fire? Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what I can do. Front facing. Completely useless, and that card just disappeared. All right. Uh, oh, I can use this. Yes, I can. I then I can use this too and get rid of him. Yep. Put him in the invisible bag. Good. <laughs> the cloaked bag. bag. Yeah. And then I can use my rear facing one and do one damage to this guy. Yeah. Uh, I mean, and there's nothing in my forward arc, so yeah. uh, that's all I can do. Uh, you can commit those two phaser cards to the mission. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, I suppose. I might be able to finish the... If I pick up an engineering, I'll be able to finish the mission. Oh, that would be great. All right, so check mission status. We're down to three. Um, and then threats move and fire. Oh, this is the this is the horrific part. Okay, let's count. So this so one go, moves forward one. One does one damage, and we lose a card because we're. Yeah. Or no, that's the rear uh, of the set. Saucer. All right, then this one, and then well, this one moves forward one, all right? Yeah, so two new cards, gone. Yeah, that's, so that's one card. Two cards. Why two? Because both of these move forward and fired. Yeah, okay, and this one gets disappeared, right? No. Nope. 
And then we have the uh, Klingon Battlecruiser. And it moves forward once and fires. Fires, we got no. <laughs> Alright, uh, two new threats, please. Oh, no, thank you. Well, um, so how many more cards did I get? I need to get rid of? I got two already. Uh, Alright, so these are the cards. These are the options I got. Okay, that sounds good to me. <laughs> okay, so, and then you want to. I'll do the this guy? Yeah? Yeah, yeah, let's just roll the die. Roll. Let's see what we got. We have four? Hmm. Alright, one good side. And then. Six. Six? Well, I, mean, I guess that's. Get rid of this guy. That's nice. And then we do two damage. So basically, we we lose when we run out of cards. Yes, yeah. or the entire ship is destroyed, which we're not far off. <laughs> we got one section left, one and a half sections left. All right. Are you, are you done? Uh, I think so. Right. Okay, and your turn. And draw four, uh, three cards. Dave, I got a white card. What is it? Uh, which one? The one in my hand. Or commit as an engineering credit. Really? Okay, so that's my engineering, along with my dilithium, along with that. You know what? You know what that, that third mission. Mm-hmm. Reward, yeah. reward is rotate the Enterprise to a facing of your choice and repair one shield section. I'm going to put that uh, token right there. Two missions to go. Two missions, crew. I'm going to let you rotate it, because last time I did a rotation, it really messed everything Where up. do you want me to <laughs> rotate it to? Wherever you want. I don't want to partake in the decision. Does it really okay. does it really matter? Because well, we just repair one side, right? Yeah, and the cloak ship is going to move forward and cloak. It won't fire, and then it might move any direction. So I think we should just leave it be, really. Hey Dave, can you, uh, with my Scotty, can you take out that damage on the right? The right cell? Or the right saucer? Here? Yeah. Forward or back saucer? Well, the one with the damage on it. The, oh, the damage only, not the destroyed yeah. section. I can't repair or destroy it without uh, Delithium trying to change it. All done! And All then right, we need Delithium. to fix, re re repair shields, right? No. <laughs> And repair one shield section. Which one do you want? Oh, well, I do one of the ah. attack ones. Probably facing five there, so the well, rear. You, you... Okay, this one. Sweet, we've got one shield facing. Oh, crap. Okay, whatever. Uh, reset that mission timer, I'll put it down to zero. Okay, I'm gonna put up. Uh... Do we have a border yet? Yeah. No. Okay. All right. Threats move and fire. So that guy, yeah, damages that shield. Red alert. This one moves forward. Up. That guy does one card. So yeah, we're discarding one card. If only we could move her to the star base. <laughs> oh no, we lose the dilithium. Okay, two new threats, please. All 
All right, Kors Balcruiser. Does. Goes into four. To your cores. Uh, after placement, all Klingon ships gain one defensive value, never exceeding starting value. Well. Darn it. Yeah. Well, that's unfortunate. Extraordinarily unfortunate. <laughs> that's up to two, and that's up to three. Okay, the next one is a Klingon bird of prey. Uh, oh, nice roll. Good job. Six. Okay. Finish your turn there, sport. Let's see what I got. Ooh, tritanium. Anybody got that lithium? Ooh. What didn't we just what did we just use for the last mission? We used everything. We used everything. What was the material material? What well, was phasers, right? It was a command credit or something. Yeah. It was was that the lithium? Well, if you use your time travel card and go through the stack, you can get a Dilithium, right? Uh, in theory. But let's uh, reveal a new mission. That's the next one. Oh. Boo. Alright, which TOS mission do we have this time? Oh, it's the Doomsday Machine! Everyone's favorite. An ancient planet-killing starship has crippled the Federation ship and is attacking the Enterprise. Uh, mission parameters. There's no time limit. Oh. Roll the die and place the Doomsday Machine token in the long range sector. During the threats, move, and fire phase, the Doomsday Machine moves clockwise one sector and fires two damage attack. The Doomsday Machine is immune to Enterprise attacks. Oy. Uh, players must commit one engineering, one science, one command, one titanium, one dilithium to complete the mission, thus rigging a crippled Federation ship as a gigantic bomb to destroy the Doomsday Machine. Oh, and the reward? Do not draw any new threat tokens this turn, and you may repair and or rebuild up to two hull sections. Nice. Oh, we could really use this, guys. <laughs> okay, so what do you have, Dave? All right, so, um, so hang on. During the threats, move and fire phase, Doomsday Machine moves clockwise. Okay, so I got to replace this thing first. Roll the die. Two. Alright, Doomsday Machine. I have a command card if you need it. The only thing that... There's the dilithium in the bag. Can okay. Time travel. Yes. So this is what I'm going to do. I'll use time travel. Look through the top 10 cards in the discard pile. Yay. There it is. Okay, I'll take that one. Sweet. So I'm going to commit to the mission. One titanium. One dilithium. One science. Dave, are you sure you want to commit that card of uh, for science? Uh, you it's a big, it's a big hit. You'd be able to take. Yeah, and we. Oh, yeah. yeah, I guess we have no time limit. So okay, fair enough. Uh, but of course, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. Okay, so I'm going to play my cards. I'll use a multi-range front photon torpedo. With checkoff? Checkoff only works on phasers. Okay. So that takes him down to one. 
to my long range front phasers to take him down to zero. Yay. They've got a long range side, which I can't do anything with, unfortunately. But, I mean, we've done some damage here, so. Mm hmm. Okay. We made good, good progress on our mission. So, now. Yeah, what's the problem? Well, the Doomsday Machine. During the threats move and fire phase, Doomsday Machine moves one clockwise one section. Yeah, there, and does two damage, so get rid of two cards. Got it. Alright, then this guy becomes a border and does two damage. Got it. Two more cards, it's gone. This guy does one shield damage. So our shield's destroyed. Does he does he get destroyed, Jules? No, nope, nope, not until stays. Uh, the hull is completely damaged. Okay, and then this guy moves forward and cloaks. And two more threats. Oh, weird. For some reason, I got three. If we do finish this mission, we'll be maneuverable again. In theory. Uh... So Romulan Battlecruiser. Klingon Battlecruiser. We've seen worse. There you go. We have seen much worse. I am panicking, but just not panicking all that much. <laughs> Let's see what Nick draws here. My turn? Yeah, it was Dave Van Zister. Yeah. Uh, he's kind of shellfish like that. Fuck. There you go. Oh, boy. So what do we need? We need a science, a engineering, and a command. I have command. I have three science. Okay. If you want to play one. Oh, you have tritanium. Hmm. I have two titanium. Okay. Ooh, nice long uh, torpedoes. Yep. And none of I can't. Sh I can you not use any of my phasers. No. And no. I have Wait, a no, long I... range side if you want to trade. Um, yeah. Uh, no, wait, that wouldn't do... It. Yes, yes, it would. You'd be able to hit that, dude, if you want to trade. Here, here, take my short-range rear. Mm -hmm. What does Tritanium do? A repair one damaged hull or play. Rebuild one destroyed hull. Okay, so we don't have any damage. Everything's destroyed. Uh, yes, that's correct. Okay. So that doesn't really do anything. So I can commit one of these Tritanium to the mission, right? And there's a science credit? Yes. All right, well, there you go. What else do we need? We need a, a command and an engineering. Um, all right, so... All right, so then I'll do is my short range side, reduce this guy to one. We're two turns away from losing the game completely. Okay, well... All this mission. <laughs> uh, long range side, so that'll do with this guy one. Right? Mm -hmm. Is that all I can do? I think so. Okay, so now is what? Move and fire? Start with that doomsday. Uh, doomsday machine does two damage, moves clockwise, two cards gone. Got it. Well, actually. Oh, no, this, no, this... you're right! That would destroy that section. Bring those cards back. I'm pretty sure we're gonna lose some. Not yet. 
Yeah, Julian, Jesus. I clock ship. <laughs> and that might change. Alright. Oh. oh, yeah, let's deal with the cloak ship next. Hey. Do? What does that do? Clockwise. So it goes here. Oh dear. We just lost the match. Oh no, that doesn't shoot yet. No. Yes, it does shoot. Yep. Pew, pew. Wait, doesn't this do damage to this hull section? Yeah, but uh, this one here will also deal damage to the hull Ah. Uh. <laughs> we just lost. I blame Julian for his initial fuck up. I blame Julian for his initial fuck up too. Hi, I'm not Julian. Well, thanks for playing Star Trek Panic. That was fantastic. We'll play it again sometime <laughs> in the future and we're going to do better and we'll invite more people. Maybe more people would help it. I don't know. The more people, yeah, might. But that's might. a lot of. Well, thanks for joining SGN in Star Trek Panic, and if you like, uh, you know, playing games and stuff like that with other people, join us at StonewallGaming.net. And that's the end of the stream. We'll catch you next week. Good night. Bye. Bye.